long hauler here and look at where we're at. Let's definitely get some bling bling for all oh, Big Blue.
Hey Jamie, come check this out. Hunter Rail Car Company. Does anybody know it? That's cool. Look at this. Toolboxes to put in your truck. That's cool.
See ya. Well, there you guys go. Uh, I will have to cut the sound out of that. I'm sorry. It was just uh, music playing. There's just no way to get around it. It's all monetized music. But that place is pretty cool, man. They got everything in there. And I did buy me a couple things. But I can't, I, I can show you one thing. I'll show you maybe in the next video. Uh, one thing is a surprise for John. So, there you go. I'm going to run it on over to the petrol. They actually sold out of my headlamps. Well, there you guys go. Um, they did not have the LED bulbs in stock. They had them last week, and I should have told them to put one side, but I didn't know for sure I was going to be coming back this way. And they were like, yeah, we got some in stock. And I came in there, and he's like, man, we're out. And I guess they got 10 on back order, 10 sets, but he said they've been back order for a couple weeks. So they took my name down. I'm gonna, I'm actually at the Petro. I'm gonna see if they have them here. He thought maybe the Peterbilt across the road, thought maybe they had them, but he called over there and they don't. But I'm gonna stop in here at the Petro. They got their own chrome shop. I'm gonna stop in there and see maybe they have them. Um, but there was another prime truck with disc brakes on the trailer. I gotta talk to a driver. I, I know I got uh, a subscriber up in the UK, said he has those for years or for a while. Said they work great and everything, but I wanna talk to a driver who has one and let's drive him around and ask him some questions, maybe interview him about it. That'd be kinda cool. But um, I'm gonna go in here and see if these guys have them. And uh, if they don't, then this guy over at the other Chrome shop, he took my phone number and everything else and email address. And he's going, he said he'll get right on it. He said the first one that comes in, it's gonna have my name on it. He said if he has to, he'll ship it overnight to me for free. And um, I told him, I kinda told him, hey, I got this huge fancy YouTube channel. I didn't do that. I did tell him, I, said, I asked, because when I went in there, I asked permission to video in there and stuff. And, um, and he was the manager. So we went to him and he was like, yeah, go for it, dude. So, I just wish the music would have been playing, you know, they got other music for the customers, but, but, um, they, um, he said, you know, he, he took seriously told me, he's like, I told him what I wanted to do, and he's like, man, if the first one I get in, it's yours, he said, if I got to, you can't get here, he says, I'll overnight it to you, so, that's pretty cool, um, I'll show you in the next video what I bought there, but, pretty cool stuff so I'm gonna go in here and see if they have the light bulbs I'm looking for if they don't we'll just wait for those guys and but man that place is loaded with some stuff I'm frustrated right now I can't think straight I just had a phone call um, when I was getting in the truck I got, I got a phone call from JB Hunt I'm still employed there It was the HR department. And they're like, yeah, we need to get an update on you. Uh, we have you on leave. And I'm like, I quit. I talked you know, to the terminal manager. I sent the emails to my my fleet manager. I sent an email to my fleet, you know. And they're like, well, what did it say? And I said, well, I just said, basically, I felt like you guys were uh, pushing me out the door and um, that you were really mistreating me. And I was one of the top employees there, everybody said. And then, uh, and then you wanted to sell me to a to a thrift store making 10 bucks an hour, uh, working as a cashier and, and also working in a back sort and nuts and bolts. I says, I'm not gonna be demeaned like that. I says, so I sent them a letter and said I quit. And she's like, well, you have to word it that you wanna terminate your, your uh, leave. And she goes, if it isn't worded that way properly, then it's not, it can't be taken as a uh, resignation, resignation or whatever proper res resin whatever you know what I'm talking about and um, I was like whatever I said I'm not sending another letter I don't really care if it's proper or another not and she's like well and I and then she and then I uh, she goes so you're done with workman's comp and everything and I said well I'm getting medical treatment 
And she goes, oh, well, she goes, well, then you'll be on leave. She goes, you're still employed with J.B. Hunt until that is done with. <laughs> so I'm working for two trucking companies right now. That's crazy. So I don't know, whatever. Um, just breathe, relax. Not a big deal anyways, who cares? But um, I hope everyone out there is having themselves a great day, a great night when they're watching this here video. And if you're not, go back and watch the video before this. It'll make you laugh. <laughs> and then you can try to have a better day tomorrow. So I'll catch you guys later. Bye.